Hello, welcome to Reliant Technology. This video will show us how to create an aggregate from the command line interface, known as the CLI, using 7-mode and NetApp storage system. Let's begin. So first of all, we're going to type the aggregate command to create with a question mark. This will basically give us the switches that we're going to be using during this video. We're going to create an aggregate. AGGR underscore Reliant with a dash R which is the RAID group size. In this example we're going to use a RAID group size of 16. Please refer to the technical specs for your model of controller uh, for the RAID size best practices. Now we're going to use a dash capital T which is the format of the drive and in this case it is the FCAL which is the fiber channel arbitrarial loop and then we're going to do a lowercase t which is the RAID group which is RAID DP NetApp uses two types RAID 4 and RAID DP RAID 4 is for single drive parity RAID DP is for double parity in this example we're going to use double parity and we're going to use 5 5 is the number of disk drives that we're going to be using to create this aggregate from the spare pool. At this point we do enter. The aggregate has been created. We are now going to go to the NetApp on command system manager and we're going to refresh this screen and from here you can see that the aggregate has been created. We'll do an edit and you can see that the aggregate name is AGGR underscore Reliant total capacity is 1.3 terabyte and the RAID group size is 16 as we set in the CLI command that we ran and it is RAID DP. Thank you for watching.